Hi Aries, it's L here to do a quick uh, weekend reading, okay? Um, it could resonate with you, it could not. Sun, moon, rising, check your other placements. Um, thank you to all who like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel. It is much appreciated. Let's jump into this, okay? Aries. <laughs> Great, so basically this is a reading of Either Aries or the other person inquiring about their love interest, about what's happening with the relationship. Acquiring, inquiring, excuse me, inquiring about, for some of you, this is like very specific. You want to know if this person is losing their wife or their husband or vice versa. This is someone, this is what someone is asking you. You want to know if, um, how and when are they going to do this? Are they actually doing it? This is what, what Aries is asking, um, their person. The cards are asking you to communicate with compassion. Um, look at the bigger picture. See the bigger picture here. Uh, do you want this person in your life or not? Because if the pressure is too much for this person, they're going to walk away. You want to talk to them about this failing marriage and what are they going to do about it? Are they getting out of it? Are they reconciling with you? Are they coming towards you? And you may be kind of tactless with your communication. You just want to know. And this person may express to you that they can't make a move right now. They're trying to save money. They're trying to preserve where they are, you know, their status. Um, that they, they love the relationship with you. But right now, all they can offer is it's time, energy towards making the strides toward, you know, divorcing or leaving this person. Someone is saying I have to stay because of the children, the money, the children, uh, the family, what will people say, the community. Aries is not trying to hear that. Aries wants to know, um, are you leaving? What are we doing? You want to make plans with this person for the future. And it looks like it's, it's halted. This person may say, you may be disappointed in their response because maybe they led on. There was something different. There was something else. It wasn't what you expected that they were making moves and making strides toward being single, towards being able to be with you. And now they're telling you the, the adverse. They're telling you, hey, work with me. We have to, we have to, you know, be, be diligent in this. We have to um, be balanced, take a balanced approach. Um, it says be careful of how you communicate with this person because, you know, they're, they're very prideful. Uh, maybe they're a, a person of prestige and you may break their pride down. Um, yeah, be, be careful how you communicate your point of view with this person. Uh, this person, if not married, they have someone else. Maybe they might be expressing that to you and maybe expressing that they can only offer, you know, fun times and enjoyment, but nothing stable, nothing outside of that, especially not now, not they're not saying not ever, but they're saying not now. Once again, it can be very disappointing to you because you feel like or you know that you guys have more than just, um, you know, fun times and, uh, you know, those types of things. You feel like it's a stronger connection. Um, someone also just outside of the marriage story, someone may be saying that they don't have a lot of time to spend with the Aries because they're trying to make more money. They do want to marry you. You are the main person in their life. Um, they have to uh, 
keep up some type of level or, or status or people are watching them. They, they have a big community of people who is always watching their next move and what, they, what they're doing, what they're driving, where they live. And they just have this, this image to maintain, okay? So they're asking that you um, give them some time to get to a place of where they can be for some of you. Some of you, they want to be a rich husband or, you know, you, you want the rich husband. They are a husband to someone else, you know, back into that story. And uh, they want to maintain that level. They don't want to divorce and then get with you and be a poor husband, I guess. Um, so someone's looking at that also. Um, people, someone's definitely worried about gossip and he says she say and what the community would say um basically the cards are telling you that this is not that this person doesn't love you that they don't want to be with you that they're not making plans with you but it's just that there's a big elephant here in the room that maybe you guys aren't communicating rationally about you know the, and the elephant is either the marriage or money needing to be made so that there can be a marriage secured I don't know um some of you you just want to know if this person was making strides toward you guys getting married and being together or strides toward getting out of a marriage and then you guys being together that's all that this communication is about. You may be, even be asking the person about the, the problems that were in the past and, and you guys' relationship trying to make plans to get over that, be better, have the relationship expand and grow. And this could be in business also. So if you, if this is a business thing for you, um, you're just trying to grow and learn from the, the past and make some moves. It, it, it looks like some of you might have a business partner if that's if it, this is business for you. Um, someone is telling you, they want you to know that, look, they know that, that you want a rich husband or they want to be that to you. So that they, they're working hard to do that. Okay. Give them time. They're trying to get everything in order. They also want to tell you, if you call or text, I will answer. Read that carefully. If you call. So they may not be communicating with you exactly right now, okay? So if you call or text, they'll answer. Um, someone, especially those that who are not free to choose, they're saying that I would choose you. Uh, someone is saying, look, I'm healing from my upbringing. Work, you know, yeah, work with me. Please work with me. Someone is saying, please work with me and, and give me time to get my affairs in order, married or not married. Someone is asking for time. Um, it's, it's greatly and heavily disappointing to you because you feel like you'll only be someone's lover and never their wife or husband or home, whatever. Um, and then someone else is feeling like is disappointed because they thought that things would be happening faster than than they actually are. But don't worry, they are they are ha they are in the works. Disappointment again, two of swords again. Um, this might cause some upheaval, some outbursts, some triggering for some of you. Um, it's just at this point, you have to make what you will of this relationship if it's fulfilling enough, stay in it. If it's not, then you know what you need to do. The cards are just advising you that if you do communicate this weekend about future plans, expansion, you might not hear what you want to hear. It could be greatly disappointing to you. Um, right, because someone is saying, I have to stay with my family. Okay. Um... Aries, I hope that this resonated with you. If it did, go over to the website and book your own if it resonated with you. If it um, 
If it did, go over to the website, book your own reading there. Take advantage of the, the uh, text to question. Also, you can text your question to the number below. Pay for your question on your mobile device and receive the answer to your question on your mobile device. Take advantage of that. The number is below. Also, go over to the website and book there. Take advantage of that coupon code that's below also. Thank you. Take care. Many blessings to you.